The Great Stupa of Sanchi is one of the oldest stone structures in India and an important monument of Indian architecture. It was built in the 3rd century BC on the orders of Ashoka the Great. Its center was a simple hemispherical brick structure built for the relics of Buddha. To venerate and protect the relic, it was covered with a chudra, an umbrella-like structure symbolizing high rank. Uliyun's tomb was built on the orders of his first wife and chief consort, Empress Haji Begum. Construction began in 1565 and was completed in 1572. Haji Begum was so saddened by her husband's death that from then on she dedicated her life to a single purpose, to build a memorial that would become the most magnificent mausoleum in the empire, on a site near the Yamuna River in Delhi. Ember is the fortified residence of Raja Mansingh I in the eponymous northern suburb of Jaipur, on the crest of a rocky hill behind Mauta Lake. Mansingh, one of Emperor Akbar's first military commanders, began construction of the red and white sandstone fortress palace in 1592. National Museum in New Delhi, India. Established in 1949, it houses a variety of objects ranging from prehistoric era to modern works of art, located in Janpath. The preliminary plan of the National Museum was prepared by the Gwyer Committee set up by the Government of India in 1946. The museum houses about 200,000 works of art, mostly Indian but some of foreign origin, dating back more than 5,000 years. Lake Palace is the former summer residence of the Maharajas of Jagniwas. The construction of the building continued from 1743 to 1746, Mora Dynasty. Abu Daipur. The palace was built facing east, allowing its inhabitants to pray to the sun god at sunrise. Generations of Udaipur's rulers used this cool palace for summer vacations and to hold durbars in its colonnaded courtyards with its terraces, fountains and gardens. 